I actually cannot believe that I'm telling you this right now, all right? I want to tell you that if you're scared of making a build on your own because you've messed up time and time again, it might not be a bad idea to start using these Pro Tool builds, all right? Like, it sounds gross, but you gotta check out this video right here because today we are making a stretch slammer. What the freak did I just say? I don't know. <laughs> I don't know. To this day, I still don't know. But this is by far one of the most rare stretch big builds in NBA 2K25. And you might actually be shocked at the stats on this thing, all right? But before we even get into that, I want to let you guys know that I am running an October giveaway. All right, we are going to be dropping mad content and you have multiple entries to get some free VC. So right now I'm thinking about at least doing a hundred dollar giveaway, but maybe I can split that into four different winners. So four of you guys can get about like 75K VC. I mean, it's free VC. All you have to do to enter is like this video and comment down below, stretch big. That's all you have to do. It's free, it'll take you three seconds, all right? And you'll be entered into this raffle, multiple entries for our different videos throughout the month, but that's what we're doing right now, all right? So, enter in the giveaway, get you some free VC. I mean, why not? We are going to be using a Pro Tune build today to make this stretch four. Now, when I tell you the name that you get, and when you actually see it at the park, it's it looks kind of toxic so let's go ahead to our power forward and then we're going to go outside scoring and then we go to our stretch slammer now check this out the description versatile inside out score a threat from deep but can put the ball on the floor and finish in a variety of ways at the rim inspired by aaron gordon what the freak so check this out not only are you a crazy threat from three but you also can catch lobs hold on hold on hold on hold on, hold on. goal posterizer on a stretch big is diabolical all right it, it simply put is diabolical now for this build we do see our height is going to be six foot eight our wingspan is going to be 244 pounds and then our well our weight is going to be 244 pounds and then our wingspan is going to be six foot nine all right let's go ahead and just look at these other stats so for our attributes this is already going to be set onto our build so we don't have to do anything the the game is literally doing it for us What's simple? Oh, okay, that's simple view. All right, so for our close shot, we'll have a 75. Our driving layup is going to be an 85. Our driving dunk is going to be a 93. So we get we get contact dunks on top of having a scary three ball. That is actually insane. All right, hold on, hold on, hold on. Driving layup 85, driving dunk a 93, and then our standing dunk is an 81. So this build might just be the one build that might just be the best popper build in nba 2k25 in the in the right hands i would say all right so not only can you go and rim run but you can hit somebody with brick wall which will be bronze hopefully a tier two batch you can always uh increase that brick wall you hit somebody with brick wall and then you go and pop so you can pick and roll, you can pick and pop. The offense is going to be insane. Honestly, if it's a two man offense going crazy, this might be, I might actually try this build out for twos, bro. Y'all leave me some comments down below. What y'all think about this John right now? So we're not doing too much out the post, but our mid range is going to be a 77. We can hit a 77. With our three ball, we will have an 87 three ball. If you cannot hit with an 80 three ball, in this game you you probably need to work on your hot spots or something or you you just need a better jump shot but an 80 is my minimal an 80 if you can have at least an 80 i mean you can get crazy with like a 76 but an 83 ball is pretty much all you really need 
especially as like a casual player i'm not one of the best players out here i don't care to be but an 87 three ball sounds wild like i like that 74 free throw so you can bring this build to the wreck if your heart desires pass accuracy is high enough to get the ball out of your hands if you're in a bad situation so 78 pass at it's pretty good pretty good i would have went like 71 so we're getting a lot more than we expected ball handle and speed with ball is going to be a 75 so you will have some dribble moves unlocked that you could probably get a little shifty with and that's kind of scary because um yeah that's that's the last thing you need on this power forward build is some dribble moves because now you're dominant interior defense is a 74 so is our perimeter defense which will give us that bare minimum of bronze defensive badges sometimes that's all you really need especially if you're actually good at the game that's all you really need i mean you don't need too much on this game and we see where all of the attribute points went to and that's on offense <laughs> that is on offense um perimeter steals the 73 blocks the 74 i like it offensive rebound we don't really care about because we're not going to get too many of those so i mean if we miss a dunk then we're probably nine times out of ten we weren't going to get an offensive rebound and i'm going to be shooting threes with this build because that's what we could do 83 defensive rebound i do like on this power forward and then speed is going to be a 75 our agility is 71 strength is 73 and then our vertical we are kind of jumping out the gym with an 80 vertical which will unlock those um those really really dangerous and when i say dangerous i mean really dangerous contact dunks for us but we see the build we have to go in and um let's see if we can take a peek at these uh can we take a peek at these takeovers i might have to go back but yeah we get aaron gordon lebron james and scotty barnes that is actually pretty crazy so we're just going to go ahead and take a peek at these takeovers real quick we're just going to test build so off the rip we get the lebron james dunk yo like it actually gives us freaking yo this is stupid it already gives us all of the uh the animations bro what the freak okay that's actually that's actually insane all right um yeah i mean you literally have your choosing of any well big man jump shot you that's the only restriction that's the only restriction for you and then dunks will get our pro contact dunks we'll get those um those pro contact off one foot we won't get any standing contact dunks but yeah, we're looking pretty good. Elite alley-oop contacts, because we will be catching a lot of lobs with that aerial wizard being so high. So yeah, we, we get our fair share of some really insane badges. Let's see, um, let's see, can we, I think we might have to go back out and edit maybe. Where are our takeovers here? Okay, there we go. All right, for takeover i think the best takeover for us would probably be skilled slasher skilled slasher is going to give us a plus seven at level five to our driving layup our driving dunk and also our three-point shot now the takeover ability is called poster machine it amplifies overall dunking ability and makes skilled dunks easier at level five we have a 90 nine driving dunk then we also will have a 92 driving layup and then for our freaking three ball our three is going to be a 94 so we are going to be dangerous on the offensive end when we have takeover even at like level four level three i would say level three we are dangerous because almost everything if not yeah everything is pretty much a 90 except like our driving dunk or our driving layup is close enough to a 90 all right so yeah this would be the takeover of my choice would be skilled slasher of course they're going to see that takeover they're going to see oh he got poster machine they're not expecting for you to hit threes with a 90 something three ball that's just not what they're expecting 
I'm not gonna lie to you. <laughs> That's not what they're expecting. But y'all let me know how y'all feel about this build down below in the comments. I wanna hear from you. This is a very rare looking build, all right? Because I don't think too many people will have this, maybe content creators, but this isn't a comp type of build by any means. This is just if you want a different name and you have a little bit of bread to play with, and you just want to be a little different you just want to rock to your own vibes that is what this build is all right y'all let me know how y'all feel about it down below leave a like and leave your comment okay comment stretch big stretch four so i know you're trying to enter into our october giveaway all right thank you guys so much for watching this video and if you like this video you might actually love this video that is on your screen right now click that next and I will see you guys over in this video.